Hello, so here we have another time lapse, and this is for a new map, and I'm using the new feature that came out in the new update, and it's quite questionable to say the least. So this was a four hour, 41 minute map, way longer than the other ones, but as you can see here, I just squashed a chicken, and uh oh, there's a there's a car that ran through the venue, and ay ay ay. So this one is Murder at the Disco, and it's quite an interesting map, uh, making use of the new feature where we can have uh, props that replace props with the action prop. And yeah, you can make some questionable murder scenes along with other things. I do have um, plans to actually make implement this in like a something cool that would affect the gameplay, where it's going to be like a giant mountain, and you can cut out part of the mountain so that it reveals a longer track. So kind of if like in a chimps game, if you save up a lot of money, you can just reveal a longer track for a hefty amount of cash. Um, I'll work on that and it's going to be pretty fun, pretty interesting to play in the game. And I'll see if people actually use that or not. But besides that, uh, we just have a crazy cool disco map where all of these animals get murdered. It took a whopping 44 layers as you saw before. And I wouldn't have gotten all of them besides the uh, smoking capybara, but... Unfortunately, I ran out of areas maxed at 10 areas, so I couldn't really I couldn't really do all of the animals. That was kind of sad, but oh well, you get what you get. And now this is kind of a quick video of me playing it on chimps mode. And uh, for chimps mode, uh, it's kind of difficult, not the craziest thing. It's kind of weird, like you can't get villages and, and the placements are also super strange because they go through these tiles and the black is made of tires, so you can't place on that. So it's kind of weird, but it works out well. Uh, there's pretty good amount of length to it, and there's some overlap. Like, you can get a tower that reaches all three lanes at a few points in the track. With that being said, there's no, like, real meta strategy going on here. I just decided to get some random towers that felt cool, and because there's, you can't really place villages in it, I kind of just said, well, screw it. I'm just going to get some random towers. So I went with Sai as the hero first, I wasn't really, I didn't really know what I was going to use, and I decided to all go for Wound Solver, which is kind of strange, because Wound Solver and Psy do not work together, they are not a good synergy, it's a, a clean up hero and a clean up tower, but that's alright, because I went for Moab Domination later, a little bit of a, a struggle to get, but I ended up getting it, and that just wiped everything out. Um, Boon Solver, Moab Domination, good combo, also Moab Domination and Psy is a pretty good combo too. So for this map, we're doing the map challenge again. So if you want to try out this map, which I highly recommend, and you beat it on chimps, you can go over to my Discord server, submit it in the map challenge channel, the screenshot of you beating chimps on it, and I'll pick a favorite one. Um, I'll be picking the favorites for the last map challenge in the next video, uh, just in case you were wondering what that was and if you win you can send me a map that i will play and on top of that you'll just get a cool roll roll which is pretty nice next map i will be playing from the the previous map challenge winner is juggernaut hole which is an interesting map and i think will actually make for a pretty good video surprisingly it's definitely a good time to be playing it because the new accolades are out and it has, as of now, 57 accolades to Chaos Jeff, who is like a random 10-year-old. So yeah, that's kind of funny. But anyways, this chimps game is ending up, so just enjoy the rest of it. And I uh, hope you played this map. Maybe you'll give it a like, because I did spend a long time working on this. Four hours, definitely longer than any other map that I've ever spent working on. And beyond that, I just think it's a really cool concept. I'm glad that there was an update that fixed the wonky layering system and i'll be definitely trying to make up some make some more maps later thanks for watching if you want to like and subscribe it would greatly help out the channel and if you want to see another cool challenge or informative guide click right here goodbye